Then I sold a pair of Nike Undercover Mock Flow, profiting $21. For these two pairs sold, I profit around $30. To start off this episode, I'm checking in with you guys because I just finished streaming on Whatnot. I streamed for two and a half hours and I ended up selling five pairs of shoes and giving away two shoe trees. For those who are new around here, I go by Sneaker Boat. I'm a part-time reseller and a college student. Now the summertime, people say it can be slower sales, but it is the time where I can put in the most work because I don't have to worry about school right now. Whatnot is a live auctioning platform, so I turn on the camera and live stream and I sell all my shoes starting at $59. In my series, Journey to Sneaker Riches, I document all my reselling. Mostly right now, it's just all the sales that I'm making and then me packaging and dropping off the orders. I'm going to try to go more in depth on the profit I make per pair, but I do want to preface first. I, since I sell all my shoes at $59, I take an average. So after fees, $59 comes out to $50, and an average profit margin that I see is around $15 per pair. Now, I will still show you guys the shoes and I'll let you know how much profit I make on individual pairs, but I do wanna let you know that I don't really look at that number as much as I look at once I sell a pair, I make $15. So essentially in my head, I've sold five pairs of shoes, so I profit around $75 during that stream. All that being said, let me show you the five shoes that I sold. First, I sold a pair of Adidas NMD R1 black and red for $16 profit. Then I sold a pair of Adidas Osmelon silver deep purple for $14 profit. A pair of Jordan fadeaway wolf grays making $14. Then I sold a pair of Nike undercover mock flow light bone profiting $21. And lastly, a pair of Nike Giannis immortality three triple white for $14 profit. Like I said, I gave away two shoe trees. So I bought these in bulk. I bought around 50 of them, averaging around $1.70 per unit. And then shipping, which I do have to pay for shipping when I do giveaways, shipping is around a little over $4. So on average, I lose about $6. So in total, I lost $12 giving away these shoe trees. In total, for streaming for two and a half hours, I profit $82. Now we subtract the $12 from the shoe trees and I walk away with $70 profit. Looking at it this way is really interesting. Honestly, before I recorded this, I hadn't really looked at the numbers, how much profit I made each stream, but $70 profit for just over two hours streaming is really good. That's still like at least, I don't know the exact math, but that's like at least $25 an hour. So that's pretty good. All that being said, now let's have my orders packaged up and today is Sunday, so we're going to have them dropped off tomorrow. Just loaded up my orders in the car from yesterday, and I'm off to the post office. Now, I did stream again on Whatnot today. I just streamed for an hour and didn't end up making any sales. It was a play pretty slow stream today. I didn't get a ton of people joining my stream, so I wasn't able to secure any more sales. But we've got my orders from yesterday to drop off, so let's head to the post office. So today's Wednesday and yesterday, Tuesday, I didn't end up doing a whatnot stream. That was just because I had a haircut and then I had to drop off some orders from eBay. So I had a, I sold a pair from my eBay and then I sold an item from my other eBay account that I just sell stuff from around the house. But today I'm back with another whatnot stream. I ended up selling a pair of shoes and I gave away a shoe tree. The pair I ended up selling was a pair of Nike Air Max 90 Navy Blue ended up profiting $15 on this pair. And the shoe tree I gave away ended up losing $6, so the cost of the shoe tree and the shipping. So in total, this whatnot stream ended up profiting around $9 for an hour and a half live. So those numbers may not be too great right now, but consistency is key. Those numbers will keep getting higher and some days will just be better than others. 
Plus, right now, during the summertime, is more known as a slower season. And back to school time, hopefully those sales will start to pick up. But just staying consistent, always being behind that camera, and always making sales. So even when I don't gain sales, sometimes I do gain followers, which isn't a big metric I look at, but it can definitely help. The more followers you have, the more likely someone's going to come into the stream and yeah, more people that can possibly return. All right, let's have my two orders packaged up so we can have them shipped out today. So I'm staying consistent with my whatnot streams and I got finished streaming on whatnot yet again today. I ended up selling five pairs this stream and I was live for just an hour and a half. So let me show you the pairs that I sold. First, I sold two pairs to one buyer. I sold a pair of Nike Air Max Evo Volts and a pair of Under Armour Breakthrough 3 Polka Dots. For these two pairs sold, I profit around $30. Then I sold a pair of Adidas Dame Certified 2.0 Black and White for $10 profit. Then I sold a pair of Nike Terminator Low University Blue for $14 profit and a pair of Nike Zoom Freak 5 Royal Blue profiting $18. In total, during this whatnot stream, I profited a little over $70. So this was a great stream and after this week, it was really nice to have a good bit of sales. Honestly, I wasn't doing anything too different. Just one thing is I need to always be talking to the chat. Sometimes I do take some down times and I'm not as talkative, but what I found that really helps is if I'm always talking, then there's a good chance someone's going to comment. And then from there, I can sew them some shoes. Also, today's stream started out good too. I started off with making those two sales to the same person within just a few minutes of me going live. All that being said, let's have my five orders packaged up so we can have them shipped out today. I just finished doing a quick whatnot stream today. I streamed for an hour and unfortunately I didn't make any sales. Now it's always funny, it seems like I have a good sale day and then a slower sale day, like I had five yesterday and zero today, but hey, at least I had five yesterday and it wasn't two days in a row. But to make up for it, I did make a sale on eBay. I sold a pair of Nike Air Force One Nocta Triple White. So this pair ended up selling for $170, so I ended up profiting $25 on this pair. All right, let's have my one order packaged up so we can have it shipped out today. Thank you guys for watching this episode of Journey to Sneaker Riches. So looking back, this episode was pretty good. In total, in profit, I made a little under $200. So I would say that was a pretty successful week. Made a good bit of sales, selling mostly on whatnot and a few eBay sales in there as well. So let me know in the comments, do you guys like when I break down each individual profit of the pairs? Like I said in the beginning, I was getting some requests from TikTok to do that. So I decided to run it for this episode. And if you guys enjoy that, I'm more than happy to keep on doing that. As well, for, next, for my next episode, it won't be for two weeks. I'm going to be going on vacation next week. So I will see you guys in two weeks. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next episode.